Hey guys, this is uh, Leon Valentine here. Um, this is my first YouTube video on my new YouTube channel. Um, hi to all you YouTubers out there. Um, I personally have seen the Rhodes Brothers do a YouTube video and I literally just watched it. And first of all, I'm going to say, well done lads for coming out as a, you know, as gay, first of all, foremost. Second of all, I have never ever heard a supportive family member like the Rhodes Brothers' father. And it was quite heartwarming actually to watch that his, uh, these two boys, their father, they were so scared. I can understand that being gay myself. And obviously, you know, I can, I, I can, I can actually understand that fear. But I've never heard somebody's father be extremely accepted. And acceptive of their sons, of their twin sons especially, coming out as gay. That is something quite, quite astounding actually to watch. Quite astounding. And second of all, to the haters that have commented on this video, commenting and commenting and commenting homophobic abuse at two brave, brave guys who have just come out to their father. Where do you, where do you guys, that's my personal question, to those who are extremely prejudiced, to those two guys where do you get off by quoting things from the Bible? First and foremost, I will say this now. I'm not disrespecting anyone's religion. That is not what my channel is about. My channel is about quite a few things, and it will be in the future, be about gaming. But that's neither here nor there. But to my question, where do you guys... Where do you haters get off on laying this homophobic crap, for the lack of a better word, on these two guys who have done nothing to you? That is, that's classed as bullying. And it's classed as being a keyboard warrior as well. I'm sorry, but... To quote the Bible, and I'm not a religious person, to quote the Bible, let he without sin cast the first stone. But yet you guys are hating on these two guys, and you're casting stones. And I've seen some positive, really positive comments from religious, devout Christians who have gotten with the times of the modern age and saying homosexuality is not a sin. And I can tell you now, it's not a sin. You cannot choose who you love in this world. Whether you're gay, straight, bi, trans, you know, that's who you are inside. And nobody else can change that. That is what makes us unique, that makes us individual. If we all followed the same way of life, we would be boring as a species. In the animal kingdom, homosexuality has been found in animals. And I'm not going to be vulgar, I'm not going to be, you know, blasé, but 
if homosexuality is found in the animal kingdom, as well as human beings, then where does homophobia come from? Homophobia comes from people's ignorance, passed down over the years, and it's taught to our children. It's taught to, you know, it was taught to me as a, as a kid, and I am gay myself. And I will state that again, I am gay. And you can hate on me, you can say what you want. It doesn't bother me because I'm not as narrow-minded as you haters are. Once again, I'm going to say congratulations to the Rhodes Brothers and say that you guys have inspired people already to come out with stories and I am aware you know that being gay and coming out is isn't the best or easy subject to talk about with your family with your friends and I have been out 10 years once again to the Rhodes Brothers Keep doing what you're doing. Be true to yourself. And the rest will come. This is Leon Valentine, signing out.